careful what you tweet applies to everyone, even the New York City Department of Transportation. A simple, familiar sentence has the DOT getting flack from the Speaker of the City Council and now the Mayor. TV 1055's Dave Carlin reports. It was a very fixable problem at this East Harlem intersection. A pedestrian crossing signal knocked over, dangling. They could have fallen on top of somebody crossing the street. This photo was from none other than New York City Council Speaker Melissa Mark Viverito. She tweeted to the NYC Department of Transportation, this is on Pleasant Avenue and 119th Street. The tweet also asks, can you take care of it, please? She was not expecting this response. Next time, call 311 for fast help. Insulted, she shot back, what? This is a joke? I thought it was stupid. Mayor Bill de Blasio joined in blasting the DOT's Twitter team for not giving a tipster, especially one as credible as a council speaker, a more meaningful reply. We want to see anyone raising a concern treated with respect. The city has never operated like this. New York State Senator Tony Avella of Queens says it is Mayor de Blasio's fault. He says he believes the mayor's office directed department heads to push 311, even for elected officials, and even though many complaints are too complicated, to fit 311's framework. The mayor agreed with you and called it stupid. Well, what he should do then is direct all of his city agencies, which he is responsible for, to tell them all to start responding to elected officials and not telling them to call 311. Some city residents say they wish they could be surprised the council speaker was treated that way. They say that reply tweet is just what they go through. Now she gets to understand how we feel in the community when we need help. No apology from the DOT saying its tweets are not auto-generated. A person wrote it and followed it up by tweeting Mark Viverito that the problem would be fixed. And then it was. In East Harlem, Dave Carlin, TV 1055. Well, the city council at Mark Viverito's request may hold hearings investigating how the city handles complaints.